I'm rolling my sty six. This is some of the information I've just written down. Uh, this is um, this is the second movie. Um, I've gone over some of the information first movie. I might do more later. But this is the second movie, which is broken down into three sections on three different planets, one in each section. The first planet they go to is Alpha Centauri Omega. The second planet is Trappist IV in the Trappist system. And the third planet is Arcturus Prime, now in section three. Now, while he travels to Alpha Centauri, first of all, on Alpha Centauri Omega, he and Liberty X, also known as the Liberator, that's their model, the Liberator, or simply Liberty Freedom, which is a personal name, um, played by Katy Perry, the, um, the uh, cyborg assigned to Katy Perry, uh, signed to Wally from the Resistance, which is played by Katy Perry, um, also to Wally personally, um, travel to the Gigaplex, which is the largest assembly of high-tech robots on display uh, in a perpetual expo sort of situation on uh, in one of the cities of Alpha Centauri Omega. The corporation has many models on display of the permanent expo, and Wally dialogues with some resistance people there, and while he is chatting, Liberty X looks suspiciously at a man who is approaching, and it's it's the man Hunter X who is approaching while they're in the, the, uh, the expo. We need to go, she says. I'm busy, replied Wally, because he's chatting with the resistance people. We need to go now, she yells. Uh, the Manhunter X aims and shoots her, uh, but Liberty catches a bullet, because she's a cyborg as well, uh, with a hand and crushes it. As they flee, the, the robots come alive, because one of the resistance ha has leaders, has, uh, workers, has hacked into the mainframe of the expo, and, um, and there is a melee in the expo. The man under X is trying to get through the crowd of people, and uh, robots, go, which are going berserk, which are interfering with him. And while Liberty and Wally escape to the basement of the facility, where the Resistance fighters have a link to the mainframe of the Expo, Wally accesses the mainframe with the secret codes that he has in his head, and uh, shows them information about how the robots of the Corporation are used at the Expo to manipulate and my and manipulate mind control techniques to give people to buy them and how they are programmed to make subtle suggestions to their owners once they're bought to buy and support corporation products. Now, um, the resistance fighters save this information on a disc and the information is used by the end of this section of the movie um, to inform the public of Alpha Centauri Omega about the machinations of a corporation on the world, which pretty much deposes their uh, their uh, authority to a degree. Now, when they f when they're going to flee this, their uh, flee Alpha Centauri Omega, Manhunter X is still chasing them, and uh, they are looking for where their spaceship was landed in the field, but it's be obviously it's it's the conclusion it's not there. They've concluded that the corporation has hijacked it, but the um, aggravation the, the aggravation doll there who's in a spaceship contacts them on their uh, on their speakerphone, her headphone thing, and uh, the communication device, and he ha he controls another spaceship which is the same sort of model, which uh, lands it's a replacement model and it lands in the field, and they leave a planet ending section one of the second movie, and so and so section two of the movies as I said is on Trappist four, and section three of the movie the final section is in Arcturus Prime which is where the Agro doll was sort of created as a cybernetic organism. And it says, Homecoming or Words to Those Effects, something like that. Here we go, Arcturus, Arcturus Prime, time to get serious. Or some, some sort of course would say. So that's a bit of information. Uh, that's Wally Must Die 6.